What's up everybody? My name is Logan and thank you for watching today's video. I'm going to be discussing uh, what I do to take care of my beard and what you can do to help grow your beard. So the first thing I suggest to everybody watching this video is don't cut it. A beard takes time and a beard takes patience. If every time your girlfriend tells you to cut it or your mom says it looks bad and you cut it, you're never going to get to your full beard's potential. My, uh, my mom, for years, has always said, Logan, please shave your beard. Well, mom, I'm sorry. I'm still not shaving it. I'm going to keep growing this bad boy. I've been growing my beard now, like, for, it's been coming in uh, this way now for about three years, but I'm almost 26, and when I was 21, it really started to just come in a lot better. But I was able to grow, like, decent facial hair, when I was uh, 15, 16, but it was nothing compared to this. So if you're younger and you think you're not gonna be able to grow a beard, time is patience, okay? Just wait it out. Don't stress you're not gonna be able to ever grow a beard. It could still happen. Um, but there are some like tips and tricks that you could actually take to help your beard growth. Uh, the number one thing I suggest to people if you have problems uh, growing hair is go get some biotin. You can get that on Amazon, you can get it at the grocery store, CVS, Walgreens. Uh, basically it just, just helps with hair growth and healthy hair. Um, the other thing I suggest to everybody if you have a beard is beard oil. That's super important because it has a bunch of natural oils in it and if you put it in your beard it will help your beard to become softer it will really help with oops, lost you it will really help with uh, beard drift and it'll just make your hair softer in general and then the other thing is the beard balm a beard balm is great for shaping your beard I use it a lot because nobody likes it when your beard is like lopsided on this side or lopsided on that side so the beard balm just definitely comes in handy with that but I think that's about it. I've been uh, growing this beard now, or I've had this beard for about a year, and I have trimmed it up a little bit here and there, so it's not at its full potential, but it is always, it's just really important to take care of your beard because it's on your face all the time. Everybody sees it, so you wanna make sure it's healthy and clean. Um, but anyways, that's pretty much all I have for today's video. Uh, please stay tuned for more beard videos in the future. Just reviews on beard oils, beard balms, and just things you can do to take care of your beard. I'm going to be making videos on that. So thank you everybody and have a good day.